Okay, so we've explored this area. Here's the fire. Check this out. Oh yeah, I didn't burn that. I didn't burn the roof. Anyway. Don't mind me. Got quartz. And that's it. I also realize I forgot to bring my ore blasting bombs once again. Oh, come on. I'm just gonna eat these berries. Uh, night. So nothing's down there. Let's go up here. There is nothing here. There is nothing here. So we're pretty much done here. We can seal this off, I guess. Come on. Oh yeah, that's right. I need to get back up here. Oh, there's andesite. Forgot about that. Yeah, there's andesite on the roof here. I do need to go up though. Or, wait, what the hell? And this goes nowhere. And if I really want to, like, I can just dig my way over to it. Yeah, I got space in inventory, so let's just do that. And that's how big the deposit is. Roughly. Now let's get out of here. Oh, should collect my torches again. I don't think I'll be back here. Because that area has already been explored. But still, I got a copper lantern out of that. Six o'clock, burning daylight. Actually, daylight's pretty much gone already. Hey, my music was playing back here.
Yeah, I think I know where to stick this copper lantern. Put it in here. Give our chicken some light. Not supposed to be here. There we go. Now let's go cook another meal. So we need grains. Like I still don't have my ovens yet. Probably should get on that, right? Oh uh, well. Okay, so we got some rope. Let's just dump all this stuff here. Uh little scraps. And we do have signs as well. So we'll bring 45 gears with us. And then I guess at this point I'll just turn these excess stones. Paradites, paradite. Just turn them into stone paths right now. I really do need to put down these stone paths. Like, I've been falling behind. Uh, here's my copper pickaxe. So, I'm gonna take this over to the treasure hunter trader, which means we're gonna go back all the way to where we originally started the game and then go north from there. Like, I could probably find an alternate path if I just go directly north for some time and then go to the east. Uh, somewhere in sandstone, but... You know, I'm, I'm not gonna risk it. I'm just gonna get lost if I do that, so I'm gonna stick to the established path. I probably should get another set of grains. What was I doing here? So let's just continue digging this stuff out. Now further out away from home, like I'm gonna be doing a two by two path. But near the home, it's gonna be like three by three. Drifter over there. 
So I'm gonna leave at around three o'clock. Just so that I'll at least reach my temporary house when it's like daylight. Oh, come on. There we go. Let's get some progress on my path here. Did I forget to... Yeah, I did. Forgot about the glass. Like, I was... Doing this. Like, this does take a long time to do this. So, I might as well just get it out of the way. That should be enough. Okay, like I, I do have additional bricks. I have two full stacks of bricks ready to go. But, uh, oh yeah, or blasting bombs. Before I forget, let's just put it in our inventory. I'm just gonna use a black coal. Okay, light it up. That way we'll have our glass for the windmill. All right, let's continue digging this out. And then I guess stone paths going over here. This and this. Put away the ore or coal now. Uh, so here and then here. This. Yeah, that works. Hey, I got a lot of pads earlier on, but I never used them until now. I just converted them into stone pads just to save inventory space because I know I'm going to use them later on. And I should do it. If I can just get a path going north and south. Like, frequently traveled directions. I 
And then since I go south a lot, I might as well just have a path going that way. But enough of that for the time being. It's currently... Actually, maybe we should go now. Just gotta make sure. Get rid of this stuff. There's a tin bronze pickaxe. It is tin bronze, right? Well, I am leaving with it, so... It has to be tin bronze. Oh, I might as well just convert this, like, right now. Uh, we shouldn't need two stacks of... Yeah, it should only be one stack of pack dirt. So, we have that ready to go. Um, what else? gonna continue making this stuff ah oh. well, this is annoying ain't it okay so get this going now We got two stacks of porridge, we got our ore blasting bombs, ladders, torches, I think we're ready to go. That's my axe. Got 34 durability on the axe. That's okay, I think we're ready to go. Let's... Head over to the trader. Uh, treasure hunter trader and... Go get some stuff. We can also try to find some resin as well on our way back. Right, maybe we could also get some sticks along the way. There's one stick. Uh, probably shouldn't stop for sticks. I gotta watch out for a bear here. I've seen it prowling around earlier on. Oh, there's a cave here. Why am I doing this? Hey, a ruin! That's why I'm doing it. And here we go. It's one of these ruins. It just has... Like... Those gears and that's it. And this is a dead end. Just light this on fire. Very tiny ruin anything anyway. There's nothing here. So it's fine. Find a torch it. Also gives an indication that I was there before. The okay, body temperature is still 37, so I'm still good. I haven't traversed this area in uh, quite some time. Pretty sure it's relatively safe. Like, I didn't see any wolves before.
Whoa. Like, who turned off the lights? Should I even be out here when it's this dark? That's water. Oh, fuck. No, that's a wolf. Shit. Okay, uh, head back west. Let's go south for a little bit. Actually, I don't know where I am. <laughs> All I have are my directions, so let's go south for a little bit instead. It's also freeze. I think I was around here for the berry run. Let's just hug the wall. Like going out like this in the dark is kind of tricky. Because even though you kind of know where you are, you really don't. Because... Like, you just can't see that far in front of you. Okay, so... We go in this direction. Keep going east. And then the agricultural trader should be somewhere in this direction. A little bit northeast. Gotta watch out for holes in this area. Since... Like, there's some really deep holes here, but at the same time, no resources. Okay, we're okay. The rabbit's up there. What, you don't have any light? The fuck, man? Got anything to trade, Hector? You sell beeswax. You also sell honey. Oh yeah, I can also sell you some bismuth bronze tools. Empty skeps as well. Like, I can't make that much from empty skeps. And if, if for whatever reason I need flax seeds, well, I can get it from you as well. And berries, of course. Homes. Like, would it be worth it to buy honeycombs from you? Like, it's one gear for each of them, and you got 19. Wait, let me double check real quick. Beeswax. Like, it's actually better to buy the honeycombs than the beeswax. Anyway. Let's keep going. 
It is five o'clock. Okay, cut through this area here. I did burn this area. Just need to get back up here first. I'm really surprised that the agricultural trader doesn't have a lantern or something. Okay, this is the area that we burned. And then this cave over here, wherever it is. Wait, where is the cave anyway? Don't want to like fall into it. Yeah, where is the cave? Like, I did identify a cave over here somewhere. Oh, it's over there. Like, this is the burned area. No, that's not it. Okay, that's the cave right there. That's a black coal deposit, but... Oh, that's a wolf. They respawned in this area. So, we gotta avoid that. 